Angels are speaking to you today. Cling to and celebrate the things that keep you going, even when it was difficult. See that when nothing was going your way, the hope in your heart did not give up. Even if you are still struggling, be grateful for how far along this journey you have come. Remember that just because today doesn't feel okay doesn't mean tomorrow cannot be good again. Find your joy in silence and stillness. Be at peace with where you are today and be open to receiving a miracle tomorrow. The only thing your soul needs right now is for you to let go. Let go of any part of you that doesn't align with the person you are in this moment. Let go of your doubts and fears. Let go of what you can't control and be proud of what you've already accomplished. It's the small, selfless acts of love that will ultimately recharge your heart and mind. The further you deepen your faith, the farther your spirit will take you. You won't have to look for any signs when your soul is ready to step into a new chapter. They'll appear on your path at the perfect moment. You won't have to question whether or not you're going in the right direction. Your intuition will have already confirmed that for you, a new era of your life has now been unlocked. Your spirit finally learned how to be in control. That was the key you needed all along. You shifted in ways only you and the universe could ever understand. The amount of faith you possess now is overwhelming, greater than any fear that may have once restrained you. All the magic you have yet to discover is going to surprise you unexpectedly. This chapter isn't anything like the others. It's significantly greater. Breathe it all in. You're no longer approaching the realm of breakthroughs. You're standing directly in it. What is your soul calling you to do? Your journey is matching the same energy you're putting into it. Are you ready and willing to answer the call of your highest self, elevate your spirit, and watch what happens? Because the way you're about to level up, if only you knew, the best is absolutely yet to come. Everything else was just practice. I never removed the Red Sea for Israelites, but I made a way for them through the Red Sea. I never prevented the brook from being dried up in the place where Elijah was hiding, but I provided what he needed. I never took the situation from Daniel's life to be in the lion's den, but in the lion's den I sent my angel to protect him. I never took the situation from Samson's life away, but when he prayed and I helped him, I gave him strength. In the present you may be going through some situations, some situations you may not even know why that is happening, even at that time, you still know that I am with you. Move on by trusting me. If I made a way through the Red Sea for Israelites, if I provided Elijah what he needed, if I have sent my angel to protect Daniel from the lion's den, if I have heard Samson's prayer and gave him strength where there seems no way, I will be with you by opening new doors which can't be shut by anyone. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.